It counts to be a boss, ain't a damn thing free I'm looking like money, all eyes on me I'm in love with my money, boo What it do, what it is, what it do, what it is Your boy Mr. Mike gone, shoebox down south Y'all already know We got another review for y'all Not wasting none of your time If you ain't already subscribed to my channel Go ahead on, hit that like, comment, and subscribe button and I talk back, please give me a comment whether you like the video or not. But we got another review. I ain't going to make it long on y'all. Let's go and get into it. This was today's drop. Y'all see the box. Y'all already know. Y'all seen everybody else's video, but I'm going to give y'all my take on it. Box label reads, Air Jordan 4 Retro, colorway black, white, anthracite black. Size 11, personal pair. Let's get into it. Open the box, flip lid box. You do have um, a little uh, product code uh, in red. Let me see if can I can get it at the angle. Oh, down there, you got a QC, um, QC print a stamp on it. And you got the product codes right there. But, uh, and you see, you got the paperwork. Right there. Y'all already know what the shoe is. I'm going to go take it out. Keep giving y'all the long run on it. Oh. And you do have a YMD sticker in the box. I'm about to lose the shoes. Can't damage the shoes. Can't lose the shoes. They got these wrapped like hoagies and everything. But voila. Today dropped the Air Jordan 4 Fear. I want to say this. I don't know who Telling Nike to lace these shoes up this tight for them to be looking like they boats and everything. This is a size 11. It don't supposed to be looking this big. But <laughs> we're going to go and get into it. And for the sake of this video, I'm going to take this little cardboard. Um, I guess this is a protector um, off the tongue. Let's go and get into it. Got that white eye sole with black traction pads. Black um, mid, mid sole uh, traction pad. And with the jump man right there. Uh, and we got this white with gray midsole. Uh, and this is a gray gradient. It's gray right there. And then the gradients from uh, gray to black with the speckles in white right there. And the air heels are red inside. I don't know if you can see that. Hold on. Oh, brand new shoes and the air here is almost already clouded. But this is a good shoe. I never had this shoe. Fear for They only released a certain amount of pairs. I think it was like 74 pairs uh, back in 20, 2005, I think. Well, this 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 is a grail to some people. You know, they released the Fear Pack with the uh, black. I mean, with the Air Jordan 3, Air Jordan 4, Air Jordan 5. We got the Air Jordan 3 last year, getting the Air Jordan 4 this year. And hopefully we get to the Adrian 5 next year. Let's check it out. It does have some good uh, new buck and leather on it. And that's a soft uh, gray, light gray leather around the forefoot of it. And then on the toe box of it, you got some darker, even better leather around on the toe, books, toe box. My bad. <clears throat> it wraps around all the way around the heel of the shoe. Which you do have that white jump man on that black heel tab right there. Medial side, just like the um the lateral side. And going up the tongue, you got that black knitting like you have on the sides. And you have these white waffle lace holders, or eyelets, shall I say. And then you got um the jump man tag. Jump man in flight. You got the and it's in uh the jump man in the flight is in black and the uh, tag is in white. I don't know why they got these shoes tied so tight. Make them look just like they want to float somewhere. <laughs> Take out this tissue paper. Pull the insoles out. That's what it looks like on the inside. I haven't done that in a while. I gave you that in-depth look of the inside. But you do... Had his dream cell in soul. And it's uh black plush um not it's not nylon um 
I forgot what this fabric is called. And I just did a video with the same fabric yesterday. I don't know. Getting older. <laughs> That's all I can say. But anyway, you got the size the sticker right there, size 11. And then you got the uh, jump man in white right there. And on the back of the tongue, and, and this, I know this white sock liner and this inner tongue is going to get dirty quick. So I'm going to protect all that. I got some protecting to go on. And I don't use shoot, rejuvenator. They ain't paying me for it yet. Um, anyway, you got the Air Jordan on the black tag. It's, Air Jordan in white is on a black uh, tongue tag. Production dates are... Um... 05-15-24 to 08-13-24. Three-month run on this. And these shoes are sitting where they were sitting. I know I was the second person in the store. I went to um, to City Gear to get these, and I didn't win on a raffle. thought uh, JD Sports was going to give me in-store EA. They gave me online EA, but I'd rather have them because I wasn't going to wait on them. So, But I didn't get online EA. I mean, I didn't get in-store EA. So... I went and got a first come, first serve from City Gear. As y'all know, uh, well, what y'all might not know, City Gear and Snipes doing first come, first serve always, they were. But City Gear just got this information today. They were bought out by um, JD Sports. And so now they're actually entering their own raffle system. It's kind of crazy because City Gear and Hibbits were together. You can still use your Hibbits points, reward points, on City Gear. But they're uh they are a part of um jd sports now so they will start eventually doing raffles so enjoy the first come first serve while you can because they're going to be probably giving ea or probably giving just raffles on city gear from now on but moving on getting back i went off on a tangent right then and everything this was a grill shoe and a lot of people let these shoes sit. I mean, and like, uh, I was, the store opened up at 10 o'clock. I was there at like uh, 10, 15. I was on the second person. And people were coming in, but they weren't picking up the shoes. They were asking about the Air Jordan 3 Black Cement release, which releases uh, next Saturday. I forgot what day it is. But that's what they were asking for. So a lot of people, they I guess they're making conscious decisions. Um, they were like, I'm not gonna spend uh, what two ten on this shoe, two fifteen on this shoe today, and I'm gonna have to do the same thing next week. You know, and I understand because Nike dropping a lot of shoes and clustered up, and they dropping a lot of shoes that we like. But you know, sometimes you know you do have to make that decision to pass up and just uh, double back on it. That's what I think a lot of people gonna do. But uh, I'm just giving y'all. This overlook and my view on this shoe, dope uh, concept, dope shoe, loved it. Uh, didn't want to pay resale for it. Thankful that it released again. And uh, yeah, that's about it. And this, this, and I thought this was leather. I didn't pay attention that much at first. I just glanced at the shoes, um, looked at them when they was on the counter, made sure my pair was good and everything. And I didn't glance uh, too hard, but. Now, this was leather, but it's not. This is another black new book around the ankle collar. So, yeah, this, this is actually a dope shoe. I don't know why people let them sit, but they won't sit long. I guarantee you this shoe is going to be sold out probably by next week. But let me look at my other shoe because I didn't look at that one. And that whenever we have these natural um, fabrics, they say that that's why they wrap them like that. This shoe looks pretty good, too. I don't see any uh, glue stains or anything like that. And I was going to give y'all an overview. Oh, well, not an overview. A blast from the past on a pair of shoes. Um, but I'm going to say that for tomorrow's video. I'm trying to pump out more content. Get y'all back in the rhythm of um, looking at my videos and everything. If it's something I do, I need to do to improve my videos, please don't hesitate to let me know. I do engage. I do comment back to everyone who comments on my videos. You know, I would be more than appreciative if y'all would. But um, I love y'all. Salute. You can't lose till you quit. 
Stay down till you come up. And you boy, 2024, be your force. And that's a wrap.